this was our day three in america this is the day we started the conference at apa and as you can see we started our day so well we got in uh, have a look almost everyone here they have a tag the same tag like the one i have if you've not watched the previous video you will see it yeah so we are heading to the conference here my name is Teresa Keneka. I'm a clinical psychologist uh, and the CEO of All Smiles Therapy Center and Rehabilitation Center or Rehabilitation Facility. We are based in Kenya and I'm a member of APA, that is American Psychologist Association. I'll share more about what you do if especially you're joining us for the first time. Yeah, but before then, now you see conference started. We had very, we had different rooms. And this was our room. So I was among those presenting the first session. We'll be sharing an entire video during presentation and all. For now, we've just do, done a cut. Uh, we've done a cut of my presentation. So yeah, we were seated somewhere along midway. And I must confess, all this time I was thinking, oh my goodness, how will I be able to present? You know, there is always that thing. I mean, First time for everything, and so it was my first time to present to as many white people as it was. Uh, however, it turned out to be one of my best presentations ever. So I did about childhood traumas, and there I was. Um, we didn't capture well during introduction. So here I am uh, during my presentation. It was a 20 minutes presentation. Uh, where the first 10 minutes we did the presentation and the last 10 minutes it was all about now the Q&A engagement for q and I think as it, at that point um, I finished my presentation. The requirement was you switch off now the PPT and you now start engaging with people. And yeah, uh, it, it was such a lovely experience. This is where I warmed up because now people are asking questions and the questions were not about come up again. What did you mean? You know, or it was actually, you know, like more feedback. They got what I was talking about. Yeah. And they were very much interested. One thing about the West, they are more into individualism is versus us who are collectivism. So they really needed to know even in a collective uh, culture, how the trauma, you know, how kids, even with the parenting, how the traumas and all that, how they gain or they acquire these traumas. So yeah, we had much of engaging. And yeah, within no time, my 20 minutes were over. There we were now from one conference room heading to another. I think here yeah, we just got in and did a few. So it was so, so many um, conference rooms, so many presentations going on. We had before being asked to do the phone app so everyone had a phone app and you are registered in each and every morning you register the conference that you want to attend to somehow i thought ours wouldn't have as many people but to our surprise boom it was so full yeah they also had the exhibition part of it so let me explain to you in kenya each and every time we have a conference we have a gathering and especially a corporate or a professional one people will come to showcase so this case, first, the people who came, they were all uh, for psychology-related fields, be it hospitals, research institutions, universities, and all that. But one thing, back at home, what we come to showcase, they are our products and services. Ladies and gentlemen, let me shock you. 95% of all the people who are showcasing their services here, they were, you see their side careers, they were actually, they came to hire this was my very first culture shock of course apart from seeing being in america alone is a culture shock um learning everything around but getting to an exhibition and learning that here people they are actually they're they telling you why you should work for them oh my goodness for the first time i felt um how am i really going back to kenya like each and every you know um table that we visited and I, i'll be showing you more i'll actually show i i we collected some brochure we'll show you so yeah this was at the evening now we walked presenters for the day we were meeting for dinner so here we are walking uh because this was in a different it was in hyatt um hyatt regency but they have several hyatt so it was in a different uh place a different street within the town this is seattle town and you can see the lovely seattle town oh my goodness it's very, very lovely. 
very the moment we'll uh, post the one for space needle you will understand what i mean by it being lovely and please just capture moments you know uh, the building they are the buildings because they appear so well uh when you're doing the space needle so yeah here we are still uh finding our way uh dinner was for presenters for the day uh we also had some collaboration with a certain spp university in california so a lot of things happened anyway uh so we are still looking for our way and you can see the beautiful streets and mind you when we talk about dinner i know someone might be wondering how comes we went for dinner so early i think this was around 6 p.m but you'll be surprised to learn that even as late as 10 p.m it was still like this so we were already in for the dinner and here of course so here not everyone we had two dinners so we had one where for all the members but now i think each and every day the presenters had their special dinner and meet up you can see we were so many like we never met I, I i can't even remember seeing any of the presenters i'll also be showing you the president for apa is it for that time because she did the opening so she was part of this dinner yeah you can see we are there of course a lot of um people catching up some work together uh the person there is the i think the dinner uh spp California school. This is a school for psychologists and all. Yeah, that lady is now the president. I think they have an election uh, coming up soon. So the current president APA. So yeah, she also gave her speech. Speech took like 15 minutes. Three people like each five five in. We were back to do our thing. So you can see the town. Now, during this time, I think it was around 8 p.m. if I'm not wrong. So 8 p.m. at night and still it's like daylight. So I want to believe people in the U.S. and especially in Washington state, they no longer operate with darkness. Like in Kenya, as darkness means night and uh, natural light means day. Because, yeah, I think now here we were leaving from dinner and we left some few minutes to 10 p.m. So yeah, this is some few minutes to 10 p.m. It's still uh, like a day. We have natural light. Yeah, so again, we were walking, crisscrossing the town, back to the bus stop. Because in America, you just don't stand anywhere. And the bus stop, you just use the app to get to know where the bus stop is the number for the bus that you're supposed to board and at what time will bus be there so yeah we had done, yeah that's hyatt regency so we had done everything where we were for the dinner now here we had done everything we knew where we were headed for the bus stop and i must confess this was such a nice experience i think we would all be using buses even in kenya if only the public means system can also be streamlined and Anyway, we see that at the beginning there is no much similarity, but yeah, we are heading there. We are also not all that badly off. But yeah, this is a developed country, so let's get to enjoy. So walk in the street, and clearly you can see it's at night because there are no many people. This being um, in town, Sierra town, there is no so many people uh crossing the road so definitely when we say it was around 10 p.m now you understand yeah so such a great experience um what was saying is at all smile we run a rehabilitation center for mental health that is for addiction for any mental disorder we have a psychiatrist um several psychiatrist doctors who will also be there to attend to you also this goes to our center professional counseling we see from kids, teens, couples, adults, groups, corporates. We are so big when it comes to e ARP. Nowadays, we just don't call it EAP, e EAP, Employees Assistance Programs. We added resilience because it's all about resilience and quality of life. Yeah, so continue enjoying our walk across town at night. This is there 10 p.m. or past 10 p.m. at night headed to the stage to book our matatu back home. It was such a lovely, lovely experience. Yeah.
we took a few photos please enjoy yeah so we have a team of psychologists um of all ages who can be able to see you your loved ones we take insurance as well so we operate or rather we work with insurance companies most insurance companies in kenya for all mental health be it for couple for corporate so call us call us we are all here for you we are all here for you. we serve 24 7 which means even kenyans in diaspora we are able to serve you and in kenya we have branches in eldoret nakuru kisumu mombasa and nyeri now plus our nairobi office and our rehabilitation for treatment of addiction and all mental um, disorders management and treatment where we have also our psychiatrists, our psychologists, our nurses. We are an entire team. Our conference ended after three days, 8th, 9th and 10th of August, having started from 7th. And yeah, it's such a great moment of remembrance. We are happy. As mentioned, a lot of people came in. You can see help us lead the change in georgia so a lot of people came in their exhibition it was more of the jobs they are offering so this was part where we had the psychologist professionals from hospitals mental health facilities even mental health you know uh, rehabilitation facilities uh institutions and all and you can see the mark that they shared you will be able to see so provincial health services authority uh, there is somewhere there you will see join our psychologist team today and just to mention this is because it was a psychologist conference there is a lot of hiring out there you get to a bus it's still written we are hiring you buy from supermarket okay here there is another one even for people in research they were also not left out they are still taken care of uh, the professionals uh, the professional home for health service psychologist licensed psychologists can apply for this you see, like for their outlet for exhibitors, aha, uh -huh, another one, licensed psychologist needed. You can even see the benefits. They're giving you the benefits that you'll get there. I, if you are a professional, Alcoholics Anonymous wants to work with you. So much more about this. We are hiring. They even telling you the state and you can apply now. Wow, it was amazing let me say it was just amazing even to get to learn all this so yeah and all this about the jobs it's a lot not just for psychologists it's only that i was in a psychologist conference but even out there we encountered so much uh, you can see another one there they're even giving you the benefits let's talk about working together as a team so so many brochures i'm sorry for that you know I don't know uh, how we we did that video, but yeah, you can see we are hiring. We are hiring workers psychologists, and this is all over. You buy from supermarket. The way at home supermarket at the back is thank you for shopping with us. Uh, you can see even the USA they had something they were hiring for. Here it's not about that. Here is thank you for shopping with us. Come back again, and there it's we are hiring. So hiring is right, left, and center, and it's across all the professionals. Of course, I, I was in a psychologist conference, and that's how I gathered these particular brochures, join our team, now hiring for positions at all levels. So this, we got it there, but let me say, um, when we talk about unemployment being a third world problem, I now came to confirm, we were told some organizations, they closed, because they lack not because they lack demand and supply or people or you know but because they lack people to work for them yeah so when we say america is a land of opportunity we actually mean so and not just for psychologists yeah so ladies and gentlemen don't say that i never brought you anything from america though i'm still in america it's good to mention today being when is today today is on 23rd august on on friday so at kenya i know you are very much asleep here yeah, it's at 2 p.m 2 p.m there i'm sure you are around maybe almost mid actually you're already on saturday at kenya i think it's 2 a.m they are about or 1 a.m yeah so i brought you a lot of things a lot of goodies to tell you there is so many opportunities in america you can search them website just search for jobs in america if that's your dream yeah so at Walsmans, we also do training, short courses, certificates, diploma, and mental health first aid training for psychology program. We are accredited by TVET and CDAC authority to offer diploma and certificate courses in psychology. 
make us your mental health organization and let's walk this journey together so thank you keep watching we have so many videos to share with you uh that's all about the conference video so the rest will be more about exploring america the city uh the space middle and so many like we've had fun thank you bye bye